Porisho lives in a rural village in Limpopo called Khamatabat. The village is surrounded by beautiful mountains with a host of plants and wild animals. It sounds idyllic. But Borisho has written in to ask about the local vervet monkeys. When food is scarce in the mountains, the monkeys come into the village to raid the crops and houses. The villagers have noticed that the monkeys aren't scared of the women who tend the fields, but will run away if a man approaches them. Borisho wants to know if this behavior is normal. The answer is an indisputable yes. Anyone who's been to any of our national parks will be familiar with the daily raids by monkeys and baboons on the various camps. I've often seen both species bully women but run away when a man approaches. There is no doubt in my mind that vervet monkeys can tell the difference between male and female humans. And this seems to have nothing to do with size. Even when I was a teenager, vervet monkeys were more wary of me than they were of my mother. This ability is not unique to monkeys. Research has shown that crows can differentiate people by their faces. Research conducted with masks showed that crows would scold masks they recognized as being dangerous from previous experience and actually got worse over the years as other crows learned from their friends. Recent studies have shown that laboratory rats and mice respond with less stress to female human researchers which means that we might need to revisit many of our studies using these animals to correct for this effect. There is even evidence that pregnant women are more attractive to mosquitoes, although there the mechanism is a little bit more innocent. Pregnant women, and indeed men, are larger, give off more heat, and breathe out more CO2, all of which makes them more attractive to mozzies. So it seems that wherever you look, animals can differentiate between male and female humans in different ways.